I mean, there's there's international wrestlers all over. I mean, that's hence the word international. So I don't know that there's gonna there's a governing body that would cover all of us um, because. We're putting our body at risk every time we step in the ring because we want to entertain the crowd. So we go above and beyond every time we're out in the ring. Every time that camera's on and rolling, we put our body in harm every time. Um, so it's hard to find good insurance. So um, with doctors out there and with them, their cooperation, maybe as we get older, we can get their help and their assistance to in our older years to, to study our brains and to study our body to see what they can do to help us to where we don't, the, the trauma doesn't affect it as much, as, as, as affect us as much. Because I've had both knees replaced, I've torn my bicep, both shoulders, multiple concussions, I don't know, over 100, close to 200 concussions. And I've probably spent more time in the hospital than out of the hospital, but it's not gonna it's not gonna stop me from doing what I love. And you never know. I mean, you don't want to talk about the, the worst days, but maybe you know, you hear about people, well, maybe I'll die act in the ring or acting, doing what I love. Um but that's kind of a morbid thought, but maybe I go entertaining the crowd when my last moment comes. I'm getting goosebumps thinking about it, but maybe that might be my time is when I'm out there one day entertaining you, that might be my moment. And, and I'll die happy because I'm entertaining you. Uh, when I, when about all of his, everything that he's contributed to wrestling, um, you have to look at the people for the individual of what they've done in life. Um, and people select who they want to think good about or think bad about for one moment in time rather than the lifetime of the career, which that's really not fair because you look at Chris Benoit for what he's accused of doing for one day of his whole life. Do people judge Michael Jackson the same way? Look at all the other celebrities out there that may have one bad experience that they're judged for that whole life, you know, and I really don't think that's fair because we're all human. Everybody has a bad day. I don't think there's one person in this room that hasn't had a bad day that they couldn't take back and wish they would change. That's, we're human. But we have to pick ourselves up and keep going. We can't let the bad things and the negativity get in our way. We just got to keep trucking and Entertaining and entertaining the masses. Um, there's like one of my one of my friends, Eddie Guerrero. I mean, there's many of us because we put our body through abuse, even doing acting. That's one of the reasons I wanted to get into acting because I could perform and it's on film forever. In wrestling, we got to go out there every night and do it every night over and over and over. And that's a lot of abuse on our body. So that's why I chose to get into acting because I think it'll live on longer. But unfortunately, that you take, a lot of my brothers and sisters take uppers, downers, things to get you through the next day. Sometimes when you're on the road and you're away from your family for 100 days or more at a time, that's depressing. And it affects everybody differently. Everybody's an individual and not everybody's affected the same way. So some people choose the route of painkillers. Some people can get by with topical pain rub, but sometimes it's just too unbearable to where maybe they need a little something stronger and maybe in those cases, they just took too much and it got the better of them. Their body just didn't accept it. 